So you're probably wondering why I'm shooting it this way. Well, uh, I had a pretty terrible week, but I started feeling pretty good. I got a haircut, had a Totino's pizza, and now we're going to talk about uh, destroying a bathroom. So in this game, you're invited to a party, and it, it mostly takes place in a bathroom in the year 2008, which got me thinking, where was I in 2008? And I can tell you off the bat, I was not cool enough to be invited to any sort of party. In fact, I was more like, like this. I'd like to start off by saying, um, fuck you, bitch. Because not all scene and emo kids try to um, fit in with everyone else. But not to be confused with this. So I guess the story here is that you're an emo kid that goes to have a good old poop cry in the bathroom because I guess the girl at the party probably wasn't interested in your starting line acoustic guitar songs and uh, singing some dashboard confessional, you know, about the girls that all broke up with you and the heartbreak you felt at 15. I, I understand that. I feel you. I've been there. As you start to cry, your next door neighbor here, your stallmate decides they need some toilet paper and they kindly request of you to provide them some. And you do. What follows, though, is a series of nonsensical, albeit funny, puzzles and ways of dying. That's a gnome. Right click to get gnomed. What? What? Oh shit. Um. Right click to pull pin. Oh jeez. <laughs> um. Boring. No! Oh, me. Again? Ow. What if we just kill the dude? Kill the guy in the toilet? Yeah, we haven't tried that yet. How do we do that? With the grenade. Oh my god, you can do it. Oh. Oh my god. Hey. What? Oh, you take oh. him. Excuse me. <laughs> if your reason for searching for a game is anything like this. Whoa. I think I'm looking forward to cracking up. Uh, I hope I can like, you know, totally crack up. So uh, I haven't like totally cracked up in a long time. Then I'll tell you right now, this little short ditty is worth all 500 of your pennies and uh, plus tax. Uh, Bitter and I took us about an hour to experience uh, just about all the possibilities. And uh, this is what we came up with. Maybe there's no like real, you know, quick way through this. Maybe we got to figure out what, the... what do we got to do Maybe with we have to actually use our brain cells. Yeah. Maybe we do need Cosmos. Yeah, we'll just have to let her know and... I got you know, no... If this becomes something, hey, that she let us down. Said she's got a sore throat, had to call out of work. <laughs> Damn. This is like, uh, what's that movie with Tom Cruise in it? And it was like Edge of Tomorrow, where he just kept reliving the same day. Or Groundhog Day. Oh yeah, Groundhog Day. That's a good one. That'd be hell. Living the same day over and over. Yep. Yeah, especially if the day before sucked. Look at that catch. I'm better. Every day. How come I can't open this toilet lid up? You know what I mean? Open this toilet lid up. I can't. I don't know. It's not time for the toilet. <gasps> Run! Oh. Oh. Right. One, two. One, two, three, four, five. Check. I've oh, the queen. Seen. He's in. The queen put the king in check. I get it. All right. And then yellow door, right? We'll just, I guess, leave it alone. Take care of him. Do you have something for me? I don't know. Maybe you give him a picture. His hand. You know Wait, the what picture? is this? They're watching. What picture? 
picture of your butt? What if you give that to him? <laughs> okay. Here's a picture of my butt. Yeah, yeah, take that. It doesn't take it. Wow. What? Uh, that seems that seems like nothing. I can't grab. I don't want to get too close. I died last time I touched that damn thing. All right, I guess take care of him, huh? Uh, hold on. Uh. Oi! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! I did it! Oh shit! What? Oh, what's what this? Was that? A sushi. I don't think it's rice. All right, take care of him. Take care of him. And I don't know if this is going to work, but... Oh, it got dark in there. Nothing. Oh, jeez, fuck, Whoa. I hit right click. <laughs> So I'm watching back on this footage here and I'm realizing that this gnome kind of gave us a run for our money. I guess when an Italian like myself, also a fan of mob movies, reads the words take care of him, it means something completely different to me. So we're just going to fast forward through the rest of this. Uh, in the meantime though, if you like what you see, please consider hitting that like button, subscribe, drop a comment down below of some indie games you'd like to see me check out. Thanks everybody for the support this week. And uh, here's the rest of that shit. Okay, so we have a 9 and an 8, a 5 and a 2. Well, how about this? We start going through all the numbers for the re remaining one. Oh, yeah. So we do that. I don't know, this is kind of brute forcing it, but... It doesn't take that long, so. Oh. What was the answer? I don't know. We'll never know. I think it was a five. Yeah. What? Oh, shit. That is... What is going on and here, man? And that's all. You're back at the party. What? Huh? Are we done? Are you disappointed? Yeah. Sorry if you didn't get all the answers, but at least it was fun. No, it wasn't, actually. Oh, and I, I think I owe you one more ending. Here. Here.